Welcome to Emerge Vlog. I know you love these interesting topics, so please subscribe and tap the notification bell to receive future uploads. Yes, yeah, so today we want to talk about three at an interesting topic. We want to talk about chronic law getting implicated or you know accused of being um, buying guns or whatever. Here yeah, we see a vlogger, popular vlogger. I think he named the Jamaican police or Jamaican young police. Yeah, he put out a thing on chronic law yesterday. And Karnik Law share on him Instagram story. Say yo, young, they start mixing up. We have to share that as well, we don't know. Um, we see we are bounty killer. When you check out the review what we do yesterday, is, yo, the review the <laughs> review are going good. Just go check it out. Check it out before you go through this or you can go through this and then you go check it out. Yes, yeah, so it's all about the feud between Bounty Killer and Vegas. And as I said in the review yesterday, I think Vegas have a stand, song outstanding, but Bounty Killer couldn't wait. And Bounty Killer drop a song. And we see Bounty Killer continue to troll him. We see Bounty Killer put out a cover heart and a couple artists get involved. A couple artists in the comment section. Because Bounty Killer look like him have a next song ready for Vegas. You see me? We also cover a topic in terms of being a man. People are saying gone in a real estate. People are saying start sell us now. Um, make sure I video up on Instagram and to have the people um, guessing, you know. I wonder some other video that we share with as well. But before we go further, as I said earlier, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Emerge Vlog and tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. Say it's an art and interesting platform here over on YouTube. So make we kick off the topics. So this idea was a being man show up on one of them social media platform and we deliberately take out the audio because I obtain the video from another YouTube vlogger and him have him talking and him commentary in it. So I decided to put my talking and my commentary in it. So as I said, being a man of um, the fans speculating, some, some are saying I'm going to real estate, some are saying it's just one of them house them fix up. But being a man never say much in the video still. I'm just say, yo, this is one of the house them we have to fix up. So you can tell me what you think in the comment section as it relates to this house and what being a man is doing with it. So moving on to the next topic so as you guys might already know there's an ongoing feud between mr vegas and bounty killer so them in a lyrical feud right now we see bounty killer did a song yesterday entitled spin barrel and i think vegas was the person was to um that was supposed to respond to bounty killer but bounty killer basically i say yo vegas i take too long so bounty killer drop a song yesterday and it's a go on good you can check out my review you can check out the song itself and tell me what you think about it, you see me? So, Bounty Killer, as I say, continue to troll Vegas on social media. So, see, Bounty Killer put out a cover art. So, Vegas is a Vegas is the one was that was supposed to respond to Bounty Killer, as I say. And he didn't respond, so Bounty Killer did a song named Spin Barrel. You can go check out my review, Panda Spin Barrel song there. And you also can go check out the rest of the song them. And tell me what you think about the war thus far. You can tell me if you think Killer are lead, if you think Vegas are lead, you can tell me who you think are going to win or going to come out victorious and you cannot state to my views and opinion when you feel like them artists are too old you feel like the clash not at just state your views and opinion as I say so Bounty Killer post on him Instagram a cover art like apparently Bounty Killer have a next song coming so against him have Vegas back against the ropes right now because as I say Vegas was supposed to respond he never respond now Killer have a second cup song coming after Vegas didn't respond, so make we see how this panned out. We see other artists getting involved in the whole field. We see acting in the comment section uh, with some laughing emoji, and then him comment and I say, Yo, I would tell them to go trouble, trouble. So I guess Bounty Killer have some artists on him side, they also have a lot of fans on him side. They know Bounty Killer, them career is timeless as me. So I just that I go on, Bounty Killer seem to be on a victory lap, as I say. Him seem to take the victory at this moment, but we can uh, write off Vegas as it because we see Vegas have great potential. We see Vegas do some good song in the class so far, so we can't write him off it. Probably I just one shot him a go fire and just kill Bounty Killer, you see me? So who to tell? Let's see what Pando time time will tell. So moving on to the third and final topic. Oh, we see for the past couple of years, maybe three, four years, we see the emergence of vloggers that are, are, are have, have covered crime as their topic we see sir p being the most popular one we see people like my view we see tis and we see on the spot media them people that cover crime and um from time to time we see them cover entertainers we see um squash get implicated we see shop done we see vibes cartel and chronic law is the is the last person where we see them are implicating or something that are the vloggers them so we see a vlogger come out i think him name 
um, the Young Jamaican Police, I think we mentioned him name in the intro. Yeah, Young Jamaican Police, I think that's the channel's name. And he might implicate Chronic Line as some very serious thing. We see a youth out of East where them they kill down a Longsville Park named Bigger Crime. And basically, they might tie Bigger Crime and Chronic Law in the same thing, you know, some gun buying business. So Chronic Law come out in his own defense and him post a thing on him Instagram story. And this is what Chronic Law say. It is none other than Chronic Law. Yes, man. Chronic Law, the same Chronic Law who is associated with Squash, who is in Broward County. Yes, Chronic Law, that's artist. Yeah, man. So, Chronic Law and. And Tracy, yeah, man, my friend. So, you know, she know the ins and outs, how to separate. So, Chronic Law, yeah, man. Any life that um, those M16 take, you know that blood, that blood, you know the blood of those victims is on your shoulder, yeah man. And when I said that, I said that without no apologies. You understand? So when you, when people support these artists, and here you have it. That is an actual video from the channel itself. I think connect class screen record it or whatever, and then put him on caption like him say, yo, here's your mother. You know the. SYM, suck your mother, it stands for in a short text in you see me? So, he might basically defend himself and say, yo, big man, stop calling up my name or whatever. And that, those are some serious allegations. As you can see, it's still clearly on the, on, the, on the video, say, him buy a arsenal a gun. And basically, he might say, he might get the information from a person named Tracy. You see me? So, hopefully, um, all those allegations and hopefully, no, no, we now have a next artist getting I'm um, incarcerated or anything like that. You know, Chronic Law is one of our favorite artists. He has been one of the most trending artists for the past couple of years um, in terms of streaming and whatever. He locked the YouTube platform um, for the longest while now. I think he was the most streaming artist for last year. So we know uh, a man like that um, out of the music business again, you see me? So those are the topics that I want to cover. Thank you for watching thus far. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And tell a friend, if you tell a friend, if you tell a friend, say Emerge Vlog are one of the most interesting YouTube channel, new YouTube channel, no ever growing, and we ever thankful for the support. You see me? So you can check out my top five videos. Then we have a series of top five videos, and you also can go check out my YouTube Shorts video. Then all those actions are really appreciated. You see me? Can't thank you no more. You see me? Yeah. So. Um, you can look forward for the next video. Open hit the notification bell so you get um, a notification. You get notified when I drop the next video. So, as usual, I'm out.